All right, let's move on. Catapult? Wait, we've done this before. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> Whoa. Okay. So 40,000. And we have our car here. And we have a little thing here. So what's up with these? These blocks are here. I assume they fall right away. Let me just um, test this out. Just see what the hell happens. So that falls right away and destroys my bridge. <laughs> um, can I have like a little road up here? Just to prevent this from falling ever? Just don't let that fall ever. Okay, there we go. Oh! How about now? There we go. So let's just be able to go across. This car is kind of fast. So, do I have to do a catapult? This isn't here. And this car is kind of fast. Why can't I just... Oh, I can't build up because there's no joint here. So it really wants to do a catapult. So there's this little trick. So, um, don't mind that road up there. It changes up a little. <laughs> you know if you have a ruler hanging over a table and you slam down the end of the ruler, you'll send it flying. Uh, I learned in high school that you can actually do the same with baby carrots. Although they don't necessarily have to be on the end of the table, you could just take a baby carrot and set it down on the lunch table and slam on one end with your fist and it will launch like crazy across the room. Now I didn't know that they would get such speed and velocity until I tried it and nearly knocked out the eye of our lunch supervisor. He was known as a big, mean, tough guy too, and it would have been pretty fucking bad if we had actually hit him. And then we did it again, because it was fun. I guess lunch supervisor is a bad word. He was technically the head of security at our school, but he would, at the time juniors and seniors were having lunch, he would just also be in the lunchroom, eating lunch and was responsible for handling any fights or any problems that happened. Yeah, so we launched it a little bit this way. I'm gonna save this, come back, come back to it later. There's a chance we could pull off the <laughs> divine intervention strategy. Uh, but I want to see if I can do this level closer to how it probably should be done. What's gonna basically have to happen? We're gonna need some sort of, um, catapult that goes. So there's no hydraulics. But there are like phases. This is gonna have to be our counterweight, and this is gonna push down, and we're gonna have an actual catapult kind of fling it up here. Now we could be a bit more lenient with our catapult than last time, because the last catapult had to be reused twice. This one is a one time use thing. So, what I kinda wanna have going on is some sort of car stop. When the car hits the stop, it's gonna trigger the block falling, which is going to push something down, which is going to push the car up, and it's all gonna be connected. So I think I can have roads here, maybe. So either this or this is probably gonna be my rotational point. Now, if you want your car to go fast, the distance between the counterweight and the rotational point should be short, and the distance between the object you want to launch and the rotational point should be long. However, then there's a big greater risk of it breaking, so we need to find a middle ground. I think this here makes a good middle ground, so I think I'm gonna roll with that. So, it'll rotate around here, and then we'll have like a little connecting piece, kind of like this. So the general idea is, well, this is all connected, so this goes down. And then this will go up. However, if we run it, that's gonna happen right away. And honestly, that's not too fast. Ah, it's like a little Ferris wheel of death. So, uh, we need to definitely change up a few things. So then also we have the problem where this goes right away. The car isn't even fucking here. So we got to do a lot of cable attachments here then to prevent this from going anywhere. And basically, what's gonna happen is when we hit the stop sign here, that's gonna trigger this. Will it work? Eh. We'll see. No! No, it will not. You know what? Because this block is heavy as shit. Awesome. I love heavy blocks ruining my damn day. Oh, I see, I see, I see. So the ropes probably shouldn't actually be attached to here. They should probably be attached to here. Uh, the longest I spent on level was eight hours, so don't like expect magic to happen just like that. 
I think it requires a little bit of patience, which I know many of us don't have. Wow! Well, isn't that just fucking great? We need more support here. Are there, is there a rock or something th that I can put extra weight on or something? I need more rope. How about here? To find every attachment point I can and attach rope to here so this doesn't fall. <gasps> oh, I didn't fall for once. Wait, it doesn't fall now? Wait, so all of these ropes are absolutely useless? <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, 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 well, hold on. Let me make this one here a split joint. And detach this. Just to see what happens. I don't fucking get it. Chat, this- I've been having problems with this for like an hour before you showed up. If you're wondering what's happening here, I'm wondering the same thing. It's so fucking stupid, you change the tiniest thing and it all breaks on you. Right, so, um... Damn, this show is powerful as hell. Let's make this a regular rope, maybe. Rope is less strong than cable. Oh! Ah! <laughs> a little progress. So now this is where the physics comes in. I probably want to fix the rotational point. Let's take this out, this out, and this out. Oh, oh not all that. It'll be something like this, that. Making this a rotational point? Probably won't work. Yeah, I figure not. Yay to see that. More weight? You all think I should just add like roads up here? Don't you just hate it when you leave your roads laying around? <sighs> well, we tried. I should probably should stop the catapult max height. This is my cable that will prevent it from going too far. It just isn't fast enough. That's really the main issue. But yeah, I, 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 I like what you were thinking, right? Just stop its motion so it flings the car. But it really needs to be fast in order to do that. You think I should consider a uh, single road? Something like this? <sighs> this is that's like the most nonsensical fall ever. Ah, there we go. Still not quite there. So let's just hypothetically say this is a rotational point. So this will go slow, and then this will go fast. So there's always using the rock as a sport, which I don't have the money for. Oh wait, I can't use that rock. I can use this part of the ground as support. At least I can do that. You go one, there should be a one. We're a little bit over budget. Let's just see if this works at all. So that's a no. This likes to snap here. Can we adjust this so it doesn't snap through that? Well, maybe. Ah, oh, fuck, it doesn't rotate around here. I feel like attaching everything here might be wrong. So we're gonna get rid of this. Holy cow, I'm over budget. Well, so that's how it kind of works. I mean, it's not that bad as far as the snapping goes. It's only a little bad. Wow, look at that speed. So that speed is really good if we can harness it. So then these are kind of useless right now. Because that's not bad, okay? As a whole, that's not bad. Use cables to hold this up? Oh, yeah, we'll just attach them to the fucking clouds. Maybe we could try to pull this off or something. Holy shit, that actually attaches. Oh my god! <laughs> oh shit! Well... Let's, uh, where do I go from here? What the fuck? Let's lower this a little bit. I may have to move the rotation point a little bit further this way? Oh my god, it's almost there. Ah, uh, can we move this up at all? Oh, it's stuck. Can we move it this way? And then this way? A bit more. This way, this way. This way. This way. 
this way. It's up a little. Somehow it doesn't break. That's a miracle right there. Oh, the flip was so good! <laughs> Alright, no height this time. Uh, can I make this rope? No. Well, I was hopeful. Can I make this one wood? Wood. Can I make this one wood? So, yeah. Yeah, no, it slips off the road too soon. So that's why I had a multiple road one. But if I can get a single road one to work, that'd be phenomenal. Oh, God. Make the box heavier. Worth a shot? Damn. I actually might add a little catching road in here. Oh! <laughs> we made it! Okay. We gotta just shave $6,000 and we can move on to the final level. So actually, the majority of my shaving, I think I want to uh, have come from here. Uh, if I adjust these, it should be as inconsequential as possible to the main bridge. So we'll just start by making those wood. Okay, good start. Oh! It is so close to not making it. 4,000 to go. So, we made this one wood and this one wood. Ah, oh, yep, that matters. Let's make just this one wood. <sighs> uh, Alright, how else can I save money over here? Can I get rid of this yet? Very nice. Something's gotta maybe change down here. Let's see, can I move this here? Move this in? Alright, can this just straight up be a wood? Can I get rid of this? If I do budget again, is it gonna work? Okay, it does work. I don't know, everything looks like it's super stressed and super particular. This is like one of those challenges where removing even just the smallest thing can really fuck you. So when I should when I beat it, I should have beat it uh, first time with under budget. Damn it. Uh, as much as I would want to just like have this not be a bridge and have this be a jump, we have this being attached to here. This is surprisingly vital. Wood road here? I think I tested this. Never mind, I didn't. Oh, come on. Let's just make this longer. So it doesn't do that. Okay, you know what? I'll just run with that for now. Let's get rid of the wood entirely. This almost worked. Never mind. Every time it starts dunking it, you know you gotta just reset. Alright, let me try something I've been meaning to for a bit. Let's do uh, a little wood down here, and let's do some wood triangles around here. I always find wood is just better for supports than steel. If you're trying to factor in cost, anyways. Yes! Fucking called it, too. Oh, hey, I'm actually glad I got a level. 39,766. This is a stealth bridge. After one use, it hides itself so the cars don't know what hit it. All right, you guys ready? Uh, I didn't think I'd get here today. I really didn't. What you guys are about to see is the final level of the secret world. I don't even know what it is. Let's take a look.